Welcome back everyone, this is Ultra Lavos playing Maniac Mansion. Hopefully these meteor police are showing up soon. I think I'm just going to pause this recording until I hear the sound that alerts you that they're almost here. I'm also pretty sure that in the uh, original version there is a skeleton like on the floor chained to the wall here that I'm guessing Nintendo thought was a little too graphic. But, yeah, I just thought about that while I was sitting here waiting. I'll be back. And there's the sound. Let's go back to Bernard. I was just playing around, moving people around. Now you'll see... The meteor police coming in. And if the door's not open, they'll be mad. I think if you call them so many times without the door open, they just won't even bother coming back. You're just gonna march right on past everything. And arrest the meteor. Crater head. He's not a tuna head, he's a crater head. And now, here on the floor, is a badge, which is the Meteor Police badge. Can we read it? Badge number 714. We're gonna give the badge to the purple tentacle to show him that, oh, we're with the Meteor Police. let you get through. Alright, well let's, uh, let's, uh, let's arrest them. Well, thank you. I appreciate your help. I don't know why uh, Bernard doesn't run out of this room screaming when he sees uh, the purple tentacle. I guess by this time he's used to all this weird shit, so... And... I need the key card from Wendy, so... Oh yeah, you can't choose a new kid while you're in here. Because of some broken shenanigans, if you were able to. So, back to what I was doing with Dave. I, uh, I did some things off screen just to make sure I remembered how to do them, so I may have some items that you don't know about yet, but. go have Dave ring the doorbell and get Wendy caught because I need Wendy in the dungeon. I'll be back. Alright, so I want to give the key card to Bernard so he can go in there and do his thing. Now let's go back to Bernard who scared off the tentacle, which I think any of the kids can actually pick up that badge. Oh, product placement. Oh, he's gone. Shut up. Let's just uh, use the card slot with the card key. Now we can get in here. And all we gotta do is pull the switch. And that shuts down the machine that I believe the meteor was using to control Dr. Fred. And now he's back to his normal self. Uh-oh. Hopefully you can turn it off. Good job. And then 
and this is the, uh, that's one of the ways to end the game, and this is one of your, uh, regular endings here. Cash would be nice. Don't be a tuna head. He will repay you in wax fruit. And congratulations, you won the game. This is one of the ways we can win. One of the ways. Let's, uh, see another. I'll be back. Alright, I'm back. I'm here. I have not called... I repeat, I have not called the Meteor Police yet. So we're gonna take Bernard. We're just gonna sit him up right here outside of Nurse Edna's room. Then we're gonna get Dave. He should still be downstairs. We're gonna bring him back inside the house. He's gonna go use the phone and call somebody. But we don't have anyone's number, you might say. We're about to get that. We're just gonna get Dave in place. Dave's not really useful for much. At least he knows how to use a phone. Maybe not how to fix it, but he knows how to use it. And Wendy has the water faucet, so now we can finally go and see what's in this door. There's a sponge, which is useful uh, with Michael. She will not use the toilet, but will she pull the pull chain? She will. Will she use the bathtub? see what's behind the uh, shower curtain. Call Edna. Now in the original version it said for a good time, call Edna. Now that we put the water faucet handle on we can turn it. And then we'll turn it back off. 5235. So we'll go back to Dave. We'll use the phone call 5235 and whose number is this Edna it's for a good time right no it's just call Edna now in the original version she picks this up and says what is this a prank call why aren't you breathing heavy here let me show you how it's done but that was a little too risque so now she just thinks it's Cousin Ted calling her and she's going to gossip with him forever. And apparently not let him get a word in edgewise because she's just sitting here yapping the whole time. Starting 20 years ago. Well now we're going to switch back to Bernard. And now that she's busy on the phone... get this key and we'll head up this ladder she does have a mirror over her bed though surprise Nintendo let that slide it does seem like you know all right let's find a light in here hey look she's just got a painting wonder if we can open it oh there's a wall safe and there's some scrawled numbers. They're too small to read. We don't have a magnifying glass. What should we do? Let's get Wendy to help. What can we use? Have you all figured it out yet? You've seen what we need to use. It's right up here. This is a control panel to control this telescope. We have... How many dimes do we have? Five? Alright. Or four? 
Now, you, you only have to use two dimes and go right, right, but we're gonna go left to show off something uh, cool. Okay, so we put a dime in, then we'll push the left button. And now we'll use the telescope. And you get to see a Martian. How awesome is that? So now we're just gonna use the dime and the coin slot, push the right button. Then let's see what we can see through here. Just the tree. the dime again push the right button again what do we see now anything important just the drain well we got one more dime so let's move it right again There we go, if we didn't have the, uh, what was that, zero, one, two, zero? If we didn't have the painting open, you wouldn't be able to see that. So now we can use the save. Zero, one, two, zero. And what's in here? An envelope. Now we have an envelope. This is all we're going to do this time. Uh, we're going to continue on and get another ending and another ending next time. And then after that, I think we're going to be using some new kids to show you uh, ways to complete the game if you chose other characters. This is Ultralavos playing Maniac Mansion. See you all next time.